to do something Minecraft related, and I also seen some requests to do something Nether Portal related. So I wanted to do some Minecraft Nether Portal cookies because I thought it would be awesome. So I'm just going to make some sugar cookies. I'm just using the good old Betty Parker mix. And uh, once we have the dough, then I will show you guys how to do it. Now that our dough is ready to go, I'm going to flour my surface and we're going to roll it out. I want these cookies to be a little bit thicker than normal sugar cookies just because the portal does have a bit more depth. So I'm going to try to roll them out to about a half an inch thickness. So if you have a larger rectangle cookie cutter than I do, I would recommend using one, but I don't have one. This is the only size rectangle that I have. So this is going to cut out the inside, and I'm just gonna place it down here as a guideline, and I'm going to just cut out with a knife. I'm gonna cut out a rectangle around the cookie cutter. And this is going to be our nether portal. transfer your cookies over to your cookie sheet you're going to want to spray it with some non-stick baking spray or cooking spray just so that the cookies come off easily once they're done baking so I'm going to coat my whole sheet with this so now once your cookies are already on the sheet we're just going to grab our rectangle cookie cutter and cut out the center of the portals now grab a toothpick and grab the center and take out the excess dough. So now that we have the center of the portal cut out, we need to light it with our flint and steel, but we're not gonna use flint and steel. We're gonna use Jolly Ranchers to create the portal. So we're going to use the purple and I'm also going to use a little bit of the pink. So what we're gonna do is we're going to crush them up in tiny little pieces and we're going to place them in the center of our cookie. So I've taken the Jolly Ranchers out of the wrappers and I'm now going to use a meat tenderizer this side to crush them gently. So let's... So I'm going to do the same thing for the pink. So now grab your crushed purple and blue Jolly Ranchers and just add them in the center of all of your portals. Try not to get them on the actual cookie because they'll melt to it causing little bubbles. Now I'm gonna grab the pink Jolly Ranchers and just spread them very sparsely throughout the portal. So now once your Jolly Ranchers are all in place, we're now ready to bake our cookies. I'm gonna bake them for five to seven minutes at 350 degrees Fahrenheit. So I'll be back. So once your cookies have had plenty of time to cool, we're now going to use a spatula to remove them from the cookie sheet carefully. So now I'm gonna grab some black icing and I'm gonna have a large tip up here and I'm going to trace the whole portal around it and I'm going to make a line all the way across from one edge atop the portal and all the way back to the other side. And we're gonna do the same thing for the bottom. Then I'm going to outline the whole portal and try to cover all of the cookie if you can with black, because it just looks better. Then I'm going to make one more line on each side and continue the line for the top portion and also the bottom. So now I'm gonna use this black cookie icing and I'm going to fill in each square, each little piece of obsidian. So just cut a large hole and fill it in. And once it's all filled, you can go ahead and grab a toothpick and spread it around so that it's evenly distributed. So now to add a little more texture on the obsidian, I'm going to get these black sprinkles. They look like crystals. And I'm going to pour some in my hand, right in the center, and just sprinkle them onto the obsidian block. 
just so it has a little more texture. And we also are going to do the same thing with purple sprinkles. So I have them right here and I'm going to spread them just a little more sparse than the black. So now I'm gonna to continue to do this for each block of obsidian. Once you're done adding all of the decorations, you now have yourself nether portal cookies. I really love these cookies. I think they turned out great. And now you can actually go to the yourself. Thank you guys so much for suggesting this. Leave a comment below if you'd like to suggest something for next week's episode. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'm Quick, and I'll see you later. Bye!